The following is a non-profit fan-based parody. Transformers Robots in Disguise is owned by Studio Gallup, Nihon Ad Systems, Saban Entertainment, TV Tokyo, Fox Kids, Takara Hasbro, Osama Sakita, and Richard Epgar. Team Unlimited does not own any of the footage, music, or sound effects used in this video. The series was made for entertainment purposes only. With this being said, we claim fair use. Please support the official release. Tell me again why you want me to go to Castle Peak? Because I looked at my dad's journal and... Does it mention that he wish you would just die? That's six pages in. And also, there's a symbol that kind of looks like it's Cybertronian? He's telling the truth about the myth the symbol is the ancient Cybertronian. How ancient? He said he found this 50 years ago, but he also claimed that it was about 1,107 years old. That doesn't sound like something we should investigate. But Prime, that's about around the same time we crashed land on the Earth in the year 842. Maybe our old ship is buried underneath one of the pyramids. What the hell could we possibly need from it? It's completely scrapped. Well, what about the six protoforms? The what now? Yeah, we left six protoforms on the ship because we didn't have enough energon to bring them online. Well, I don't see the point of scavenging them. Well, if we don't, high chances that the Predacons will. <sighs> Fine, we'll go to Castle Peak. Well, here we are. Start searching. What the hell is that noise? Looks like someone may be digging down there. Bro, thanks for volunteering to go down. T fuck that! I'm not going down there! I'll go! I like meeting new people. Hey. Uh, excuse me, but me and my friends are trying to work for a note space, yep. Do you think you could help us? Actually, we're looking for the same thing. Maybe we can help each other out? Yeah. <laughs> What the hell is going on out there? Slapper, get back to work! Oh crap! Well, on the plus side, we found the ship. Optimus, I found the ship! Yes, Cyburn, I see that. Now, let's have a look inside. Yep, the profiles are still there. It looks like they're still at full capacity. Good, then coming here wasn't a waste of our time after all. Lord Megatron, did you get all of that? Indeed I did. These protoforms will make for a fine addition to the Predacon cause. Megatron, terrorize! Megatron, Prime? Megatron, Prime! Megatron, Prime! Slapper! Quit ruining the moment, slapper! And claw mode! What do you think of my hand mode now, Prime? Skybite, finish them off! At once, my lord! Prepare for immediate termination, you filthy Autobots! Crap. Run away! Run away! Ah, uh, guys? How did the Predacons know about the Stasis Pod? Your guess is as good as mine, Sideburn. See, I told you that using the anal probe on Dr. Onishi would benefit us. Ah, how? And now we shall be able to add more numbers to our ranks. That is, after we reprogram them. And by we, I mean you. Then afterwards, we shall head to this land that the humans call Africa, where we shall have plenty of animals to scan for the protoforms. <laughs> Uh, hate to disappoint you, Lord Megatron, but do we really need to scan animals? Why not vehicles? So that way we may be able to lurk amongst the humans. Go on. But not just any vehicles, military vehicles, so we can have more firepower. Didn't we just talk about this before? Your idea is... tempting. But what would we call these soldiers beside the Predacons? How about the Decepticons? I know, that was stupid. No, no, Skywipe, that's not it at all. Actually, I like it. Now that we've had this discussion, let's head to the nearest military base. Ah, 
it sure is nice to get out in the sun once in a while. But I really wish I could have met Sidebird again. <laughs> He's so cute. Well, Skybite, what do you see down there? Some tanks, helicopters, a tanker truck, and a jeep. Splendid! My fellow Predacons, witness the moment of triumph, for we are about to gain some new members for the Predacon cause. <laughs> Hey guys, I was thinking, maybe if we can't scan all the pods, maybe we can scan one that turns into a butterfly. <laughs> Quit ruining the moment, Slapper! Now you three, go scan that jeep over there. Yes, sir! <laughs> <laughs> Now stand aside, and I shall infuse these protoforms with my spark energy. Wait, why are you doing that? It's sort of a way to give our Decepticons personality instead of being a vegetable. Oh. What's a vegetable? Ugh, just shut up, Skybite. Megatron! <laughs> You're too late to save the protoforms, Optimus Prime! Behold! The first Decepticon! It... Uh... Roadbuster! Um... Lead foot! Uh... You seriously cannot think of a name for your new soldier? <sighs> Man, you are pathetic. You! Your name is Vega Octane. How dare you name my Decepticon soldier with such a ridiculous name! Actually good, sir. What if you don't mind? But I prefer to be called that name. It's very fitting if I do say so myself. Uh, excuse me, but why are you talking like that? Not sure. Must be in my programming. But why do you talk like that, little lad? Wow says I have a speech peppermint. It's pronounced impediment! Moving on. I shall allow you to call yourself Mega Octane, but I will be the one to name the other remaining Decepticons. <laughs> yeah, like that's gonna happen. I mean, really? Leadfoot? What kind of stupid name is that? Mega Octane! See to it that Optimus Prime and his degrading Autobots do not retrieve the other stasis pods! Yes, Commander! And as for the rest of you, scan those other vehicles at once! You heard him! Move it! Whoa! That was close! Three pods down, just two more to go. Now let's see. Don't even think about it, Skyline! Oh no! Skybite, you incompetent bull! What on Cybertron are you scanning? Oh, a rocket ship. Excellent work. Now to infuse all the protoforms. And there's only one pod left. You're doing fantastic as a leader. Not helping! Oh boy, truck driving lessons don't fail me now! Oh no! No! Whoa! Kelly, what the hell are you doing here? I just came here to see my cousin. I didn't think this was gonna happen. I swear! Well, this is turning out to be better by the second. Now that Optimus Prime, I'm allowing you two options. Either you hold the tanker truck completely still and allow me to scan the vehicle with the last remaining protoform, or I shall fire at the tank and truck, destroying both you and the human insect in the process. You ain't the pretty way to your world, Megatron! Tick tock, tick tock. Well, Optimus, what's it gonna be? <sighs> if you scan the protoform, do you promise to let the human escape? Prime, are you crazy? We can't let him do this! My only concern is for the protoform. But if you value the life of a human being rather than your own kin, then I suppose I shall allow the human to escape. Kelly, as soon as Megatron is finished scanning, get the hell out of here. Got it? Yes, sir. I will. 
do it. <laughs> Good. Now, witness the genesis of your destruction! This is too good to be true! A Decepticon that looks exactly like Optimus Prime! I'm as giddy as a schoolgirl! And henceforth, I shall call you Evil Optimus Prime! <laughs> With all due respect, I think I can give myself my own name! I mean Evil Optimus Prime? What kind of name is that? I would have called myself Black Convoy or Nemesis Prime! Oh, screw it! Oh. I like that name. And so you shall be scorched. No, wait! I want to be called Nemesis Prime! Too late. God damn it! Very well then. You five, I'm your commanding officer. Now hold on here, Scorch. Why be commanded this team of Frostamagnostas? And now you're not! Does anyone else care to object? Good. Now our primary objective is to serve Lord Megatron and crush those who dare oppose him. My first command, transform and fire at will! This is way too much for us to handle! Run for it! Do not let them escape! Cyber, watch out! Ah! Head on, I'm coming! Scorgy, it's time to get going. Please tell me you're not shitting me. Not at all. But we have the firepower to destroy them once and for all! I don't care. Your power cells are depleting, and is currently at 30%. Uh -huh. I look forward to the day I slit your throat and drink your blood as I dine in celebrating your desolation! Son of a bitch! He is darker than you, Optimus! Uh, darker than me? Name one time. Aaron Yeager's bomb. The It. Oh, Scorch! When we return home to the base, you are going to get such a serious spiking! And then we shall discuss a suitable punishment for you. Now oh, wait a second! I thought the spiking was supposed to be his punishment! Oh, no! <sighs> Very well. But make no mistake, Optimus! For the next time we meet, it will be your last! Prime? I'm beginning to think that Megatron started this war all because he was gay for you. Did you figure this out just now? Transformers. Well, it couldn't get any worse. I mean, at least the Decepticons can't turn into a giant robot. Cause that would be very scary. Cyber. Just... Go play with your toys. Yay! I get to go play with my toys! <sighs> and as per usual, I'll follow and keep an eye on him. And as per usual for me, I'll make sure they don't get into a fad.